Welcome to Family Product Reviews. If you are new here support us by subscribing. Today we will be reviewing the Phenolano Yellow Shampoo, 350 ml. When it came in the box was covered in the purple shampoo, and so was the bottle. It looks super dark, but it won't leave your hair purple like some other shampoos. If your blonde hair tends to grow, and feel weighted down with toners, be aware. For a product that is not designed to be conditioning, it doesn't strip your hair as badly as other shampoos, probably due to the great pH range, and quality ingredients. If you are blonde, have any cool tones, or are trying to eliminate brassiness warm tones try this. You are going to love it. The good thing is it's strong so you get your money's worth. Comma but it can also work against you if you leave it on too long, or don't dilute it to what you need. This is a great shampoo for anyone who is blonde, or wants to add cool tones to their hair. It took out a good amount of the yellow, but the pieces that were already light had a shade of purple to them. I, like most blondes, have tried quite a few other purple shampoos on the market to keep that brass at bay. Anyone who is complaining about it turning their hair purple is simply doing it wrong. Some things you don't want to do is apply it like a collar, or mask, and stop putting it on dry hair. Get in the shower, and wet your entire head. Lather it in your hair altogether, and leave it only for one, or two minutes then rinse, and proceed with the conditioner. This shampoo is an excellent way to keep your cool blonde in between salon visits. The result is great, it took away the orange color, and kind of turned it into a brown. This is a great if you're looking for a more silver blonde, or want to turn your gray, or a tint of purple. It can also turn your hair blue, or violet for a few days if you leave it on too long. Highly recommend this product for achieving silver gray hair, and to keep blonde hair looking new post appointments. If your hair is extremely dry brittle, in a bowl mix shampoo with a conditioner 3 to 1 ratio, it works. It tones all of the brassy, warm undertones, and leaves you with a nice shade of blonde. Not an authentic product. Buyers beware. Product is liquidy, dries hair out, more purple than Finola's signature cobalt color, and smells awful. It does however really strip your hair of moisture so it's important to follow it up with a good purple conditioner. Don't worry it comes off your hands fairly quickly throughout the course of the shower, and maybe one more hand washing after. It seems to absorb more pigment, and have a greater effect when you apply to barely damp hair. Also, a little goes a long way this shampoo lathers up fantastic. If you are blonde, you need this shampoo. You can't beat the price, or the results. Trying to tone down the brassy shades. And this shampoo definitely helps tone down the brassiness. It's extremely concentrated so a little goes a long way. Also, rinse down the shower right away otherwise, the shower, or tub could be stained with purple. If you leave it in too long, it can potentially turn out a little on the grayish side. Try it out a few minutes at a time, and see what works best for you. So worth that 14. It does stain the hands, and if left sitting can stain surfaces, so wear gloves or in the shower wash your hands pretty good, yikes. The smell is not great, but not as chemically as Shimmer Lights if you're familiar with that brand. Two, you may not want to allow this product to remain on your already very light blonde hair with yellow tones for more than a few minutes. If you're looking for a product similar to Shimmer Lights this is not it. This is more of a toner. It's really pretty powerful if you have very overprocessed hair you should only leave it on for a few minutes. If you leave it in long enough, it also leaves a really cool lavender gray silver color to it. Keep in mind if it stains hands it can stain other skin parts if you let it sit long enough. Thank you for watching. Do not forget to subscribe, and leave your comments below.